Hi guys, we are back here once again today to thrill you with some of our exciting movies, our uh, shots. Um, uh, what we want to uh, intimate you on today is about some uh, three basic grabs you should expect, be it on the street or anywhere, because these are very common grabs that it can happen to anybody at any time. Might be in your house, might be anywhere at all, just as I've said. I um, want you to really sit back and follow up because we're going to break them accordingly to a, a very, into a very simple form which will make anybody a layman or a martial artist to understand. I want to always remind first timers to not forget to subscribe and hit the bell. Stay tuned and enjoy this. All right. <clears throat> The first natural grab, like I said, it happens on daily basis, anywhere, anytime. Grab me by the waist, the waistline. Good. Now, you are grabbed like this. You might seem to be helpless, but no, you are not helpless if you know exactly what to do. And if your mind is stable and relaxed, like I said, if you have a relaxed and stable position or mind, you will be able to ascertain what to do at any point in time but when your mind is, is preoccupied with that tension of fear of what the situation you will be confused so you should always at any point be stable all right now from this point we have various ways to escape from this graph but we are going to like i said three so the first one is this you hold to the hand and lock this goes with the wrist lock and the twist now from here i can decide to do this i break free strike to the knee he goes down strike there and hit here i have totally brutalized him by that and after that you can find your way if you wish to all right now let's take it, watch it again he grabs the first thing you do hold the hand and the next thing bring the other hand as you're bringing the other hand you're turning in and it sinks down and go you lock the wrist pull it out from here strike to the knee and here strike there and strike here for your safety that is a very devastating technique and with that, we're done. All right. Now let's take it just for the last time, so that you have a very good view and understanding of how it goes. This time, I'll be a little bit snappy. Watch this. He has grabbed. I go there. Yes. Come there. And yeah. That is how it goes. If we still do not get that point, I bet you need to pause it and slow it down to see because I've tried to make it simple and slow enough to see. Probably for the benefit of that, let's take it one more time. Slow. He grabs. I go to the wrist. Twist myself in. Bring this other hand. Sink in. And the, from the thinking, I have succeeded to lock his wrist and affect his shoulder by this. This alone is in danger. Then I go and I free the wrist from my waistline and strike to the knee. He goes down. Elbow strike there and another elbow strike here. Like this. All right. That's number one. Now we are going to take the second grab. <coughs> Let's go to the next grab. Now, the next grab might be with two hands or one hand. Now some people will grab with one hand and in the process, they prepare the other hand to punch like you grab and 
something like this to punch. But that does not make you to, uh, does not frighten you. Shouldn't frighten you in any way. All you need to do, like I said, always relax from here. When you take a move back, he must follow you. And that is, you are sure of what you are wearing, that it won't tear easily. And you take that move back. When you take the move back, you have destabilized him. From there, you can go here. From here, you still strike on the shoulders again and strike here again and pull him off. We take that once again. I try to make it simple enough for anyone, both layman or martial artist, to be able to follow up and understand. Like I said, the first thing here is take your move back so that he will move and be destabilized a little bit. Then the next thing here, you hold here and go. See this? Strike here and strike here. Then pull him off. Okay. Now let me try to be a little bit fast on it. He grabs again. From here. Alright. Pull up. I step back and I do this. And I go one. Okay, those are very devastating techniques. Let me take it once and show exactly areas you attack. Take the grab. I move. I do this. Strike the elbow, I mean the shoulder. From here, you can dislodge this shoulder. After this, strike here again. Very dangerous here and pull him off okay we are done with number two now let's go to the number three grab now from the back okay i said you do not need to feel threatened in any way all you need to do is simple just a swift turn here a swift turn here you can strike you can strike you can strike now come up again. Watch that. I go. One. That is the process. The process of escaping from the grip is very important. If you do not know how to do it technically, you might end up not succeeding. So the first thing, you do not give him any sign. If you do like this slowly and you want to go, you can't get him because you've already given him a sign of what to do and he will be cautious. Okay? You just will laugh. It is just in a split second. Move and strike. That's it. Then you follow him up down. When you follow him up down, like I said, the face is here, you punch, the back of the neck is here and here. As simple as that. So I think with this, let's take it one more time. At least for a better view in case you've not been able to see it well we'll go again i said one strike down one two and three. so viewers we are able to at least make you to understand the three basic ways of from regular graphs that you is very common and the ways you can escape them we have many other ways but we choose to make this three we with this we have been able to to make you understand just three for now which i've already said there are more than this but follow up it follow it up systematically gradually one after the other until we come your way next time to add more to it please enjoy this i also want to always remind you first timers as you subscribe do not forget to hit the bell to be the first to get our videos as they drop. Thank you.